Today we're building a dragon egg that lights up when you hatch it, and we're using the Anycubic Photon Mono M7 Pro. For the channels for the LEDs and photoresistor, I used Anycubic Slicer to make the holes. I made the holes 7mm. Most LEDs are around 6mm. I always make the holes slightly larger as it makes assembly of electronics easier. Let's get the rest of this model printed and prepped. So now that we got all our pieces printed, we're going to start soldering all of our electronics together. Now, we're going to use this photoresistor. So the way this is going to work is think about your refrigerator, right? It's dark inside. You open the door and the lights turn on. So it's almost the exact opposite of a nightlight. So that's what's going to happen. We're going to connect our photoresistor to some LEDs. And we're going to power them with a 9 volt battery. So we're going to use a photoresistor, two LEDs, a battery connector, a battery, some solder, and a soldering iron. We're going to get everything soldered together. And if you want a full tutorial on how to actually solder this and put everything together, I do have one. So I will link it in the description below. So we're going to get everything put together. And I'll show you exactly how this dragon egg is going to light up. If you want to learn how to solder or even just see some more in-depth videos on soldering, I have quite a few on my channel. Make sure to use straight tubing over any open wires. So now that everything's soldered up, let's see how well this works. You can see when the light's hitting it, it's very bright. If we put our finger over it, it dampens the light. Let's grab something to completely block out the light. Here we go. 